All right, guys, we're back. So we've gone to do quite a few battles today. Uh, let's go on to Carmwell and uh, see how long that takes. There's another Tower of Penis available to us down there. I mean, look at it. Yeah. Exactly. Thank you, Ascend. Yeah. I gotta add Nick's laugh in still. So hearing the name Lame Ray at Aos bothered me. I know that he was taken to Laeta and put in jail. But later, he was taken elsewhere. It is unknown as to who ordered it, or where he was taken, and on top of that, it was deemed classified for some reason. What concerns me is that Blackthorn disappeared about the same time as Laneway was taken out of jail. Is there a connection? I followed the rumor and came here, but... Is this guy gonna join our party? What's going on outside? Well, time for these losers to be caught investigating a security risk. Jeremy, which of my party members would you be most likely to scissor? <laughs> Starting today, you are... <clears throat> Starting today, you are proud soldiers of the Valamian army. Be honored and serve the Empire to the best of your abilities. But sir, we're not soldiers. He's right, I've never held a sword in my entire life. Shut up! If you have something to say, then pay your taxes first. Otherwise, you have no right to complain. Can't believe it. That's just wrong. Stop your nonsense! I'm tired of your whining. A band of thugs is reported to be headed this way. I'm asking you to fight for this town, your families. It is you who must stop your nonsense. S Sir Alvin, it is the soldier's duty to protect the people. What good are they if they are to be protected by the people? Uh, I was just thinking there's no reason to use the soldiers that were assigned to us by the Empire Fernandez just to eliminate a few thugs. If that is the case, then you two should take care of them yourselves. Well, we can certainly do that, sir, but... Regardless, I must report this to headquarters. Why, you... How dare you! From the lowly Kim from family, talk to me like that. Stop! Cesare, I see it was you whom they were talking about. Alvin, I don't want to hurt the townspeople. People of Carmela, we have no intention of hurting you. You must leave this place. Hurry and go and hide somewhere safe. I told you he was going to join my party. That's it. You're all going down. Get the. Do we gotta protect Alvin? Anyway, Jeremy, which of my party members would you be, would you be most likely to want to scissor? Definitely not Chester. Aw, but Chester's a really good frontliner. I can only hold six characters, because that asshole's there. Okay, whatever. Alright. Baby Trish? She's a good spellcaster. <laughs> Krista. Looks like there's a hidden item right here. Yes. Okay, and there's another one, probably. There it is, down there. Okay. Oh, 
Oh fuck, I didn't even check and see what level these guys are. Level 11. He's gonna be nowhere near as good as he was when he was a villain. You're fucking totally right. greater than the bow range. You just got smacked upside the head of the boomerang. Did you guys hear that story about the guy who uh, hit himself in the head with a boomerang, sued himself, and won? Turns out the story wasn't true, but oh my god, people ran with it and like the apparently a lot of what they were claiming in it actually held water in the guy making a ton of money off of it because of in, uh, insurance and, and whatnot being in play. People not fact checking? Yeah, well, I mean, you know, you, you could gather right away that it was going to be untrue, but a lot of uh, the stuff being claimed within it were apparently uh, things that. Uh, more plausible. This guy's gonna shoot Trish? Man, you're as shitty a shot as you were back then. He's got a 3% chance to hit her though, guys. Didn't make it. He turned around in, in, in shame. Oh man, this guy's casting on him from up there? Alright. What is this? It's fire? Gorilla? No, Grease. It's a level 2 fire spell. Oh fuck, that actually hurt. She's got the level 2 fire magic. I think there's one girl that's been who's been eating enough to raise the average for the world. The average of what? Oh, did you know that uh, you eat 14 fikis every year in your sleep? Well, on average. There's one girl that's been eating uh, enough to raise the average to 14. Yep, sounds about right. Somehow, somehow she hasn't moved down too many tropic levels either. Dude, Alvin, you suck. What the hell? It'd be my turn now. I really want it to be my turn. You're not gonna hit him. I think he has a 0% chance to hit. Turn again. You just went. Okay, you can counterattack them. Dude got counterattacked and immediately fucked off. Saster is hitting weaker with his new weapon than he did before. Maybe the ringmail is weighing him down. We did pick up the two items though, so there's that. Missed again. 3% chance to hit. Missed again. Wrong again. 
Damn, Chester! Okay, well. That man was confused about why he died to Chester. This dude just hit her. What was his hit percentage? Four. He had a 4% chance to hit her, and he actually got her. Dude, a 22 EXP from that. He was mad because he hates Chester and Chester killed him. Oh shit, he's been inflicted with fear. I don't know what that does, but... Is he gonna like run around like a crazy person now? Or can he not attack? Is that what fear means in this? That might be what fear means. Interesting. I love how the NPCs like hit and then immediately run away. I want to throw the boomerang, but it will actually hit him, so... I think it'll hit this dude up here, though. Nope. Unfortunately, I can't hit him from there. stepped in to try to hit him. He's got a 0% chance to hit. Okay. He's not even going to try again. He gave up quick. I can't do anything with these characters here. Are you serious? I can't get him because he's under there? That is dumb. Okay, so my classic hardcore, they came up with a devilishly genius troll to get have a druid get their tier one set bonus that makes thorns do more damage. They go with a priest element force and mind control random level one mobs and put up their thorns and watch as the alliance level one players go to hit the level one mob and die to seventy plus reflected thorns. To oh no, that's mean. Be clear. Alright, he's got a four percent chance and he missed. Okay, miss. He also has a six percent chance. This guy's a little more dangerous than the other one. Well, only just a little. This guy's not dangerous at all, he's just standing there. Good job missing. I'm very proud of you. Now he's got fear on him now. He had a 91% chance to hit and he missed. What is this, FF14?
Nice. So she's probably gonna cast on. Uh, no, she's not. I guess she ran out of magic after that one cast. Okay, he's gonna try again. He missed. Good. Trish is tired of these guys' shit. <laughs> she was having none of that. Yeah, I thought she wouldn't be able to shoot over that. It's fine. Is he gonna move over? Nope. He's gonna stay right there. What the heck? He's gonna try and shoot Trish. Miss. He has six percent chance to hit Trish now, when he only had a three percent chance to hit before. Oh, I know why, because she's got a side turn to him now. Dead. Can I move still? Alright, Aisha. In fact, let's just have you finish this dude off so we don't have to worry about him anymore. He's done. Let me XP some dev points for you. Alright. Guys, this is we're reaching the uh, culmination of this uh, of this battle. Culmination. Well, oh, he's actually gonna move over, is he? Not very far. Okay, he's gonna go after Aisha. Four percent. Can he land a hit? So far, this guy has not landed a single hit this battle. Not working out in his favor. I don't care about this guy, he can... Hey, dude. Ooh, he's almost done after one hit. And these guys are weaker than their soldiers. Oh, I'm sorry. Trish is here to finish him off. She finished him off with guys. Oh, it's his turn. He's gonna get to attack. He's gonna go after this guy. He's got, he actually has a 3% chance to hit it. Everybody else has been zero, so... That's slightly impressive. And Sasser gets the killing blow again. Anyway. You can't see enemy buffs in Classic unless a mage uses Detect Magic. I forgot about Detect Magic. Oh, an Iron Ring in white and ring mail. Ooh. Chester is about to get to wear some ring mail. Hurrah, hurrah. Please have mercy on me. I thank you. Kill him. Kill him. You're not even worth blooding my sword over. No one follows through in this game. Get out of my sight. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. 
That was rather embarrassing, but unfortunately such is the case for most of blame in its current state. Then let's go now. I mean, wait. You're not gonna ask me where we're going or what we're doing? It's none of my concern at the moment. My first priority is to report that a group of thugs chased away our troops at Carmwell. Cesare? Lame Ray is alive. I came here to confirm the information about him being sent to Fort Hugo. What? Why are you concerned about Lame Ray? I'm after a man named Blackthorn who disappeared about the same time your comrade was taken from Laeta. Blackthorn? Even those who lived in Belaim for a long time do not know about his past. He appeared just as Emperor Fernandez rose to power, clad in a pitch black suit of armor. People fear him like death himself. Black armor? He must be the one who destroyed the soul. That's right, be careful if you confront Blackthorn. I will be the one to vanquish you. Next time we meet, we meet as enemies. Alvin. I guess we're even. Guess we're even. Even Stevens. Meanwhile, at Fort Hugo. This music is very Final Fantasy uh, Tactics. Hey, you know what? A group of mercenaries from Nightwell took over Carmwell and now they're headed this way. Yeah, that's what I heard. But Fort Hugo won't go down that easy. Remember General Blackthorn bringing that strange girl here the other day? Well, according to the legend, this place used to be a temple of some sort. They're gonna use that girl in an experiment ritual thing. It used to be so quiet around here. Now all of a sudden there's a lot going on. Hold! State your business! I was sent by General Blackthorn to take the girl to him. Sir, please forgive us our rudeness. Please enter. Well, it looks like Lame Ray's perfectly fine. Because Lame Ray is actually General Blackthorn. <gasps> no, crazy, right? I don't actually know that, just so you know. Ah, uh, sorry. I hope he's okay. I told him to come see me, so... Did he go back to the soul? Did he come across that black knight and... No, Sasori's alright. He has to be. Who is it? L Lame Ray. Tin. What are you doing here, Lame Ray? Did you come all the way here to save me? Yeah. Where's Cesare? Isn't Cesare with you? Cesare is on his way here. Really? Lemurie, is that true? It's true. That's why I came here, to save you from Cesare. Lemurie? What are you talking about? Why do I have to be saved from Cesare? I must take you to General Blackthorn. No! Get away from me! Cesare, help me! Cesare! I don't think he can hear you. Lamry actually has multiple personality disorder, and General Blackthorn is just one of those personalities. It's true, Cesare is one of those other personalities. Alright, what do we got for shopping here? What we got for shopping? Uh, looks like we got nothing new. Okay. Any new armor and stuff? Nothing new. Okay. Any new items. Nothing new. But we are gonna buy five of these. Five of these. And five of those. Alright. I should probably be using my seals to upgrade my uh, coins, but I'll do that later. So, Sassari did not level up. Chester's close. Sassari and Chester are both close. Krista's close. Ashes is close. Or, uh, Trini's close. Trisha's close. I know someone dead leveled. Aisha is close. Maybe not. I guess. I guess someone did. Alright, I guess one they did. I got a sworn Trish did. Hmm. 
I guess not. Alright, well, whatever. It'd be what it'd be. We've got an hour and a half left to stream, guys. Actually, you know what I need to do? I need to equip somebody else with that upgraded cure medallion. First off, we gotta put some on him. Oh, that's way better than the one I have. Alright, I'm gonna give this one to you then. Alright. On Trish, we're gonna give you... This one. I'm also going to give her a uh, Zephyr. Alright, so let's go into the. Wait, no, there's something else we got to do. Uh, Trish, you're also going to get an upgrade to your weapon because we now have an Iron Ring. Attack, hit, uh, coin fame attack, coin fame defense, evade. The only thing that goes up is it weighs two more. So, but whatever. Um. go engrave, see if we can make our uh, spells a little stronger. So for this, we're going to try this. So here's what we do. I just go through and I find anything that is better, and then I upgrade it. Uh, usually I don't find anything. This isn't worth it. I mean, it might be, but it could be better. Like This is just a straight upgrade, so it kind of would be worth it, but not really. Even that it's just max CP and... So I'll do this off stream just because this is really boring. Essentially I just go through all of them trying to find which ones give the best upgrades and then that's it. Alright. So what we could do now is... Uh, take our break, uh, but we're not going to yet. Um, go down here to this tower and start doing that. Now, I don't really want to do that because there's no story involved at the Tower of Trial. Um, you can get some gear from there, but you got to do stupid sessions, and sessions are terrible. Have I shown you guys sessions yet? So, this is a session, okay? I'll show you a session. Sessions are dumb, I don't like them. They're really annoying to set up and... Yeah. Like, the concept of them is really cool if you can get them to execute, but... Getting them to execute is the problem. What you want to do is get a six hit session on Zajiri to complete this. What you do is you just hit end, go to session, and then you move her so that she goes after Alvin. Okay, so right here. And then you turn her around so she's facing away in the direction you want the session to go. Same thing with uh, Alara here. You go to session, and there, turn her that way. Sasrae, you hit session. You move him where you want him to be in the, in the thing. Then you turn him so that he's facing the direction you want them to go. There has to be at least one square between you and the other person. Again, session. Confirm. Turn him to be here. There you go. 
expression. Okay. And we'll have him face that way. The last person doesn't matter which way they're facing. So we're gonna have him go end session. Put him after everyone and have him face that way. And now that everybody's set up properly, you go like this. You hit attack, you select the person, you hit triangle to change it to shoot. And then you knock him in there and then he gets knocked through every person in the direction. So in theory, that could be really cool to set up and do. And that's how you get gear from them, because when you kill them through a session, they uh, they drop gear, coins, manuals, stuff like that. Oh shit, no. Sessions aren't fun though. Um, setting them up it just draws the game out way longer than it needs to be. Uh, there's some stuff that you can only get through sessions. Um, the, the secret ending might be tied to it, I don't know. Uh, I didn't want to read too much into it because I didn't want to spoil the story for myself. But, yeah, it's an annoying mechanic. I don't really like it. It just feels like a huge waste of time. But in theory, it looks cool. I will grant them that. We're back, guys. It's break time.